The Democrats won't let the Republicans do anything. The Republicans won't let the Democrats do anything. It's very deadlocked. I do think we need to, to move along a little more to the middle, as we've seen being extreme on both sides. We're not getting a whole lot done. We need to get together. We need to find, find a plan. I mean, one of the things is I'm still in the military, and we're looking at massive cuts in the military. And part of that is just because the fact that they can't figure out what the, where the debt should be or what, how, what the budget should be. I believe that most of the what's going on there is, is corrupt. Most of the people that are there may be there for different reasons that I would want them to be. I'd send a message to Washington, what would I say? Um, it's something we've been saying for years and years, is try and put aside partisan politics, and I don't see any end to it in sight. But y'all need to start thinking more about Americans than your poll numbers and your politics and who's going to elect you and what people are going to give you money for. You need to think about us, not your campaign wallets and your, your polls. Take a look at those that are defending us and the fact that they are working together for the good of America. I'm not satisfied with the choices that we'll have to choose from on Saturday. I feel like there should be a, a wider variety. I think that the, uh, um, especially on the Republican side, that the, the nomination or the, the process has been kind of hijacked by the far right and that the, uh, the moderates aren't really as represented as they should be. If there was uh, a third option that was more towards the middle, that would, might be something that would, uh, would appeal to me.